Howdy, lieutenants and economists. The most volatile, evil, disgusting things on the planet, humans. If you have a video request, you can always go to assholeconsulting.com. Yeah, I am gonna charge you, kids. And that is the importance of not fucking up. You are such an asshole! All right. <laughs> Hey Aaron, please keep me anonymous. I'm currently a student at Community College in the Bay Area, planning on transferring to an engineering school with the intention of studying electrical engineering. I've narrowed down my desired schools to five. 405 are almost exclusively engineering schools. Which one would you recommend and why? Independent of state they're located. All right, the general rule here is it doesn't matter where you go as long as it's accredited. That's the general rule. Came out with studies and research. Um, so, I mean, as long as it's an accredited college, should be fine. Worcester Polytechnic work experience as part of the curriculum with students working on various engineering projects. Rensselaer Polytechnic strong ties to the various five, uh, Fortune 500 companies, IBM, GE, Boeing. Stevens Institute of Technology strong ties to the telecom industry. Most of their alumni end up working as quants. Colorado School of Mines, that's so far my favorite, but that's because you'd be in Denver. Seems respected in the energy sector. You've also spoken of it very highly in the past. Yeah, if you want to get in geology, I mean, you, you want to go electrical engineering. Yeah, do they even have that program? I'm pretty sure South Dakota and the Colorado School of Mines is purely geo-related. Uh, UC Berkeley, one of the top electrical engineering schools in the country and in-state tuition. Ah, oh, fuck. I've been to Berkeley, and it's in a shithole part of town, and you got to deal with liberal leftist dipshits all over. Uh, which one of these would you recommend, independent of what state they're in? Okay, independent. All right. Honestly, I'd go live in... Here's what I would This is what I would do. If the Colorado School of Mines offers an engineering degree, electrical engineering degree, I'd study and see where that ranks. I'm not, again, it really doesn't matter where you go as long as it's accredited. A-B-E-T accredited. I would not go to Berkeley no matter how highly ranked it is because your campus life experience is just going to suck. Uh, and then the area of Berkeley itself, dude, those hippies never left the fucking 60s. They either became professors or they're panhandlers. It sucks there, man. And it's expensive and the traffic fucking sucks. There's no reason to go to Berkeley. Uh, the rest of them, dude, I'll be honest with you, I, I, I don't know anything about them. Uh, I like the Ren Sailor because it has your strong ties to employers. Stevens Institute, if you want to go work in the telecom industry or do you want to become a quant? Uh, I, I can't answer this question for you. All I can do is say you don't want to go to Berkeley. That's the only one I wouldn't recommend. And if you're willing to go into geology or you find out they have a good electrical engineering, like if you find out they got a good and a, a decently ranked engineer, electrical engineering program at the Colorado School of Mines, do it, without a doubt, go there. Have fun. Go live life in Denver. Have a grand old time. And I know they're lift this dippy types out there, but man, Colorado. And you're in Golden. That's another thing about the Colorado School of Mines. It's on the far west side of town, and you immediately go up into the mountains after that. You're right there on the highway of I-70 to go right up into Empire in the mountains. So you're not dicking around with traffic if you want to go hike. There's still traffic that gets stuck up there, but there's even a back way through Golden that you could avoid that traffic. Um, so that's, that is my purely unresearched view. I would still do research with Worcester and Resen, Re, Ren Sailor in the Stevens Institute, but definitely go to, don't go to Berkeley. And then, yeah, if Colorado has a, an electrical engineering program, I'd go there and have some fun in life. I would take six years to graduate. Well, I, I guess it is a private school, so you'd have to probably chop chop with it. So, All right, that's it. We'll see you guys later. Toodles.